the derivative function. Let's try to understand the constant multiple rule. It says that if f of x equals to c times g of x, then f prime of x is equal to c times g prime of x. That is, derivative of function f of x, where it is defined in terms of another function g of x times a constant. If that is how a function is defined, that means another function g of x times a constant c, then the derivative of this function is derivative of g of x times constant c. So that is what it means. Now let's derive this formula. So we have f of x equals to c times g of x. Then from definition, what is the derivative of f of x? It is limit when h approaches 0 for this function, which is f of x plus h minus f of x over h, right? That's the definition. Now here, the function given to us is c times g of x. So, so we can write this as limit h approaches 0. And we have to replace x with x plus h, right? So we get c times g of x plus h, right? Minus the function is c times g of x, c times g of x over h, correct? Now this could be written as limit h approaches 0. We can take c common, right? So we get c common. And within bracket, we get limit of g times x plus h minus gx over h, right? Now applying the limit rules, we can take c because c is constant, right? h may approach 0 or anything. c is not going to change. So we can write this as c times limit of h approaches 0 for g of x plus h minus g of x over h. Now what is this? This is derivative of g of x. So we can write this as equals to c times derivative of the other function g of x, right? So that is how basically we can derive this rule and therefore we have a rule here which we are going to follow from now onwards. That is if our function f of x is equals to any constant c times another function then derivative of this function is equals to c times derivative of the other function, right? So that's the rule. As a practice, we have an example here. f of x is 5 times x cubed. Apply the formula and get the result. See, the g of x, the other function is x cubed. So we can give the answer as f dash of x is equals to 5 times derivative of x cubed. And what is the derivative of x cubed? The derivative of x cubed will be, we'll use power rule. That is 3 times x squared, correct? That's the derivative of x cubed. And so we get 5 times 3 is 15 x squared. And that's the answer, correct? That is how we can find derivative of a function multiplied by a constant. I hope you understand and appreciate it. Thanks and all the best.